The United States sent a new package of ammunition and components for air defense systems to Ukraine. According to a report from the Pentagon, the cost of this military package is $250 million. Previously, the White House emphasized the fact that there are only funds for one such military package for Ukraine, and that their amount will be exhausted without a decision of Congress. In October, U.S. President Joe Biden asked Congress to approve additional funding, including more than $60 billion for Ukraine's needs. However, the issue has been stalled in the Senate due to partisan differences over border security with Mexico. The new, 54th package from the United States includes 15 million rounds of ammunition for small arms. The package also includes the supply of projectiles for 155mm and 105mm artillery systems. The aid package also includes additional munitions for the NASMs and HIMARS systems, Stinger anti-aircraft missiles, TOW anti-tank missiles, and Javelin and AT for anti-tank systems. In this package, the US also provides components for an unspecified air defense system. It was previously reported that the Department of Defense has handed over technical data for the launch of local production of Franken SAM air defense projects in Ukraine. These projects are designed to expand the capabilities of Ukrainian air defense systems through the integration of Western missiles. In parallel, the production of these systems will begin both in Ukraine and in the United States which will contribute to the acceleration of their implementation and ensure a significant contribution of Ukraine to the improvement of its own air defense systems.